Yo, 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 it's me, Matthew again. I had to get another test, um, which was luckily this time it was a free, it was a free test. Basically, um, I was late by half an hour, so she asked me to go and go around the corner in the square and get the free test. I had to wait for about, I say about half an hour, and I met another guy from Switzerland and he was getting a, a test as well and luckily I, I speak a little bit of the Portuguese now so I was, I was able to explain to him what he needed and that, that the actual test was free so I've just checked in it's all good and I've just had a shower so I'm out I'm gonna head out now I've put all my stuff away and everything and it's about 2.15 in the afternoon in, in Lisboa and I'm gonna go for a long walk and see we, what I can find that interests me. Fabulous. So I'll see you all later. I actually stayed in this hostel chain back in 2020 and I was in, I was actually in Morocco for the first time and it was a great time being there. Since last time I was here five years ago it has changed a bit. There's more people with tuk-tuks and what else? I think the the cost of things are, has gone a bit down I think. Not up. Ooh. If you're watching, my name is Matthew. Look at these amazing buildings. These amazing buildings. And look at the architecture. Ooh. Ooh. I think in Lisbon that you don't have to wear your mask if you are walking like this but I think I think if you enter a government building or or places of interest like hotels and stuff that you do have to um, put on your mask and it's okay not to I think but I have noticed that people are very adamant in, in having your masks on at all times if you enter places of interest oh. Oh. well I feel quite happy that in, in the UK they have eased even more restrictions and they have um, they have enabled people who want to return to the UK to not take the 
Peter Parker test. That's the one that people take. That people take. That's the one people take two days before they return. And I think that the whole idea is that because the Delta variant isn't as severe as they once thought it would be, the whole idea is that the government has decided to scrap the whole pre-departure test for people who live in the UK. Some people think it's a good thing, some people think it's not that good. And let's hope it actually stays that way. I have been aware that over the past six days that my eating eating habits has changed a lot actually. I am eating less, I think. I'm more confident in speaking Portuguese. And I do have the accent whenever I can. So I think people in Portugal say bon dia. But people from Brazil say bon dia. Bon dia. To the main.
is here. Oh. Hold on. Hold on. 